In this video, I'll be showing you how to get rid of this annoying little pop-up in NetBeans. If you use the program for any amount of time, you notice that, hey, every time you click yes, it doesn't seem to remember your choice. It just keeps popping up with a little warning saying, the authenticity of the host and the RSA key fingerprint can't be established. You say yes, it asks you again every single time you run the project and upload the files. I mean, you can't just click yes, and it does work. But then you do it again, select the files, and hey, it asks me again. Also, if you're getting this little pop-up that's saying enter your password every single time, which can be kind of annoying, I'll show you how to change that. It's really quite simple. Just click on the project and make sure the current one is selected. Now do File, go down to Project Properties in parentheses, Test0, that's the name of my project. Now, instead of the Sources, the default tab, I'm going to go into Run Configuration. Now, here's just some boring stuff about where's it going to upload to, but you need to go to Remote Connection. Now you click Manage, and this tells you exactly what server you're uploading to. This little field here is left blank if you want to enter your password every single time. I find that kind of annoying. So if you just enter it here, it won't ask you ever again. Private key file, I skip that, but known host file. Right now, every time you click yes for that RSA fingerprint pop-up, it isn't saving your answer. So all we have to do is create a little text file to save that answer. I'm just going to go into my disk drive, program files and scroll down. See, we have NetBeans IDE, but I don't actually want to put it here, because what if I uninstall NetBeans? I still want to save the hosts. I'm going to create a new folder. doesn't have to be there. You can put it anywhere on your computer, just make sure you know where it is. You usually can say right-click and say Nukes Text File here, but since this is in Program Files, you can't do that. No problem, just go to the desktop and say New Text Document, and I'm just going to call it Known Hosts. Click Enter. Now I'm going to cut that file, Control x Go back to that folder I made, paste it in. Say, administrator permission. Depends where you save this, doesn't really matter at all. Now copy this file path. And I'm going to paste it in right here. So this is the folder I want to go to. And I'm going to add the file name. And don't forget the extension. Because if I have an invalid extension, it says, own host must be a valid file. Click OK to save. Now I'm on my project. Click the source files and say upload. Now the warming popped up, but it won't the next time. Notice it didn't ask me for the password. Now here it is, running the project for a second time. No RSA key fingerprint problem. Hooray! What did it do? Well, if we edit this file, you'll notice, hey, this has added a key to recognize this computer in this server so that it trusts it every time you upload. As long as you don't delete this text file, you should be able to use it for other projects and other servers in NetBeans. And I'll get rid of that annoying little pop-up every time.